Hi everyone, this is part two of our craft section. I happened to turn on the video, I thought, to show you how to cut these out. But, so I can't show you how to do a red flannel, felt flannel one, because this is the only red flannel I have. However, we will take a piece of red construction paper and we are going to cut it so that it's almost a square. And we are going to go like this. And then you're going to start, you know, maybe this far from the top. And then you curve around. And then you bring it down to the corner here. And there you have a heart. So we have a red heart, which is what people are putting in their windows. But you could also make a white heart so that you could draw on it. So here's another piece of paper. This is what I love to do. Now, Miss Bina is using the big scissors. But if you're a kid, you're going to want to use the little scissors. So let me show you how to do it with the little scissors. So here we go. We're folding it in half. And again, we go around. It takes a little longer with the short scissors, but it still works. And here you go. So now save all these scraps because you can use them for other projects. All right, so now we've got this beautiful white heart, which needs a little bit more shaping. There we go. That is better. And let's get some markers, see if the markers can write, and we can write on them. I'm writing thank you. So the adult can write thank you on there, and then your child can draw pictures, and it doesn't matter if it's your little baby using a crayon who just goes like this. I'll show you in a, in a little thing like that. Or it could be a kid who can draw little hearts. And then you want to tape this, that's why we have the tape, to your window and maybe put some red hearts on the side near the street, maybe your front door, that says thank you, because there are a lot of people who are helping right now. Maybe it's your postman who brings the mail to your house, or someone who brings packages with food in it, or packages with toys, or books, or anything that you like. So I hope that you will join me in doing this, and let me know how you like this little video, because I am happy to do some more crafts. I've been looking for them, I've been meaning to do it ever since we closed, and I've just been busy doing other things. So now we have the opportunity to do these ourselves. And so thank you 